miles per hour. This baby could really fly. Check out what just showed up. VeloWave electric bike. So something I've been looking forward to for a while. Um, the company did send this to us to test out. So I'll leave a link in the description below if you're looking to purchase one of these. But yeah, I am super excited. I've always wanted a electric bicycle. So uh, let's get this thing unboxed. So here we go. It looks like it comes pretty well packaged. We got some directions and boom, there's the bike. So this is the Ranger model. So it's the fat tire version, which is something I really wanted as well. So uh, let's get this bike out and get it assembled. So here is what you get in the box. So here's the bike, looks like it comes mostly assembled. You just need to put the handlebars on right there. There's the front tire you need to put on as well. Here's the battery. In this box comes the charger. You get to put the pedals on. Looks, looks like, uh, here's the uh, front headlight. And then it does come with all the tools and stuff to do it. So. And the directions look pretty good. Got some nice pictures on there, which is always nice for when you're assembling. So I'm going to get this assembled. If there's any issues, I'll let you know, but it looks pretty straightforward. Here she is all set up. It looks awesome. First impressions, I love the black, all black on the frame and the tires, the rims are all black. It looks really awesome. Um, assembly, like I said, was easy. Four bolts there for the handlebars, one bolt there for the headlights. The pedals just screw on, and then the front tire just goes on with a quick connect right here. And then uh, you pull it tight right there. So assembly maybe took 30 minutes, so it was super easy to do. Um, just going over some of the specifics on this thing. So it apparently has a 45 mile range, a top speed of 28 miles per hour, um, has a 750 watt motor, uh, 48 volt battery, and then uh, has these disc brakes in the front and the back. And then uh, these tires are four inches, so it should make for a pretty awesome ride. Um, I don't have the battery in there yet because it says to charge it 8 to 10 hours. So I got it charging right now, but that should slide right in there. And then also comes with a key. So once I get the battery in there, we can go ahead and take it for its first ride. So uh, let's hopefully it charges fast and we can get going. All right, I am back at it the next day. The battery is fully charged. It just snaps in place down over here. So... I'm excited to test this thing out. I initially had the handlebars on the wrong side, so the throttle should be on this side. I guess I'm used to having the throttle on this side, but uh, let's power her on. There you go, a nice LCD screen there. So yeah, zero miles, full battery. Um, here's the gear shifter over on this side. And I did notice it has adjustable shocks, so you can adjust the shocks, the stiffness over here and uh, some preload over on this side. So it looks awesome. I am excited to try this thing out. Like I said before, I, this is my first time on a e-bike. So let's see how this thing works. So yeah, you can pedal it. There you go, change the gears over on this side. Let's see how this, oh, there you go using throttle right now. Oh yeah, the brakes work nice. So let's see, is one, that's kind of going on, there you go. So, okay, pedal assist. So it's kind of helping me pedal right now. All right, so when I pedal, it kicks on. So it's like pedal assist, okay. It's like five is the highest pedal assist. Oh yeah, I'm getting going here. Holy cow, I'm barely pedaling. It's really taking off.
<laughs> I'm going like 30, this is sweet. So I'm barely paddling and it's uh, taking me up this hill here. Yeah, it goes up these little hills really nicely. Well, it's fun going down these city streets here out in the suburbs. I say uh, we go ahead and do a little more testing. All right, we made it downtown. Figure we test out this e-bike and see how it does down in the city. So we're starting off around the Pfizer Forum here. This is really cool. I don't know if you can ride your bike around here, but I think I will. Yeah, I've been to a couple games, concerts. It's a pretty nice place. All right, let's hit the streets. figure no better place to try out this fat tire bike than on some mountain bike trails. So I got my assistant with me. You ready to ride some trails today? Let's go. So that was a fun couple weeks of testing out this Velowave Ranger electric fat tire bike. So I think my favorite thing is basically just being able to drive it around with this throttle and that uh, pedal assist, which makes it so nice for traveling around the city and on these mountain bike trails. The mountain bike trails were a lot of fun. You know, I wish it did come with this back rack would be nice for carrying stuff. It'd be kind of nice if it had mirrors. It's kind of hard to see when you're driving around in traffic. But other than that, it's a well-made, well-built bike. You can tell the welds and everything are really nice. And it holds a charge for a long time and it is powerful. You know, it even comes with this headlight up there. So I definitely would recommend this bike. Um, I have a video coming up testing the range of this bike. So stay tuned for that one. But otherwise, check the link below if you're looking to purchase one of these because it is a really awesome e-bike. Thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you in the next one.